Hello, welcome to another video from Mr. Program Reviewer. Today I have a special review. It's over Adobe After Effects. Um, I haven't really done a review in full depth over a video editing software. So I'm going to show you Adobe After Effects CS4 and I'm going to do a little tutorial on it as well showing you how to make a simple intro to your YouTube production viewer. So I have it open. I have a <clears throat> new composition open here. This is what the layout looks like if you're not familiar with it. Um, it almost looks like a freeware. Obviously it's not though. It's a thousand dollar program. So <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and add a new solid. So I'm going to go to... I'm going to make a new composition first. Go going ahead and make it about 30 seconds long is fine. <clears throat> On that new composition, I'm going to add a new <clears throat> solid. On the solid, you can write whatever it is that you want to write. <clears throat> Actually, never mind, you don't have to add the solid. You're just going to add text. So you can do that by pulling up your tools and adding a text box. I'm going to put Mr. program reviewer <clears throat> so I'm gonna go ahead and shrink this down it's a little too big um, I'm gonna scale it down so I'm gonna click on my footage down here in the timeline click S for scale and drag it down so I want it like that I wanna get my normal cursor tool not my text so now I have Mr. Program Reviewer. If you wanted to anim animate that, you could just by clicking the drop down arrow on the text in the timeline. Um, click the drop down arrow on Transform. And you can click the little stopwatch on Position or Scale or whatever it is that you want to animate. And then if I wanted to animate the position, I would just click the stopwatch, go forward a few frames, move it where you want, go forward a few frames move it down, forward, across, so you can kind of see what it looks like. But as of right now, I'm just going to show you another little uh, thing that I know how to do. So now we're going to make a new solid. I want it to be a black solid. And on the solid you want to put, I'm going to go to Effect, Generate, lens flare. So now we have a lens flare right here as you can see. I'm going to animate that a little bit so it'll go over the text. It'll look pretty cool. I'm going to turn the opacity down as well. You can get to that by clicking the drop down arrow on the solid. Clicking the drop down arrow on transform. Finding the opacity and drag the arrow down so we get our text to show through there as well. So. Now I'm going to go ahead and animate this lens flare. Let's turn the opacity a little higher, or I'm sorry, more down. And then we're going to click the <clears throat> animate button on the flare center, flare brightness. Uh, click the lens flare under the effects tab. That that's all you want to animate right there. So we're gonna go forward a couple frames. Move this forward a couple frames. Move it again forward. Move it. Move it. Move it. Now let's just say I want to make the brightness come up. Just drag that. So, now you can see we have our little animated hmm, intro kind of here. You can add music to it to make it however you want it, make it look pretty cool. If you want to watch Unbox It 101's YouTube channel, you will see a little example of this. I actually made that for them. So now I'm going to go and show you how to download the trial of Adobe After Effects CS4. Start by opening your default <coughs> search engine. Go to adobe.com, 
Oops. Adobe.com slash download is where you're going to want to go. Just go to Adobe.com and click on Downloads. Trial Downloads. So this is where you're going to download it. Right here you can see it. You just click Free Trial. You're going to have to fill out some information. This was a Mr. Program Reviewer production. You guys have a great day.